Welcome back to A4A2 Media. Today we are going over how to import and organize footage on DaVinci Resolve 18. So what you're going to want to do is open up DaVinci Resolve. It will open up on the Project Manager page. We're going to go down to the bottom right, click on New Project, and we're going to give this project a name. Now we're going to click Create Project. DaVinci Resolve will automatically open up on the cut page, but the best place to uh, import footage and organize it is in the media page. Now we're going to want to go to the system storage location, double click or right click on it. We're going to click add new location. And now since my footage is in my documents folder, that's where we're going to want to import the footage from. DaVinci editing, and now we have our audio and our video. So we're going to click open. Now we've created a new storage location for me to access with my audio and video. And as you can see here, the audio and video are in separate folders. And I would actually like to keep that folder structure when importing into DaVinci Resolve and by doing that, creating new bins. So to import this footage, we are simply going to select these two folders right click or double click. And we're gonna to wanna to choose the third option, which is add folder and subfolder into media pool, create bins. Now DaVinci is asking to change the frame rate. This is so that DaVinci matches the frame rate of the footage I'm bringing in. So we're gonna click change. Now our footage has been imported into the media pool and we are ready to organize it. Let's create other bins so we know where this footage is. So under audio, we are going to click on the clip. We can go to file, new bin, or if you have multiple clips that you'd like to merge into a bin, you can just right click on the clip and then choose create bin with selected clips. We do that and we can give it a name. Since this is under audio and we just have one of them, we're gonna put music. Now we have a bin and audio, and we can locate this music through this bin. And now we will do the same for our video clips, but this time we are going to utilize keywords for our smart bins. So now that we've made a bin for our music, we can also apply this to our video clips, but this time we can utilize smart bins by using keywords. So we're going to go to this clip, which is basically just trees, and we are going to use the metadata for our keywords. So as you can see here, we're on our metadata on the right side of our media page. We are going to click on sort menu, and then we're going to click on shot and scene. And now, as you can see right here, we have our keywords in order to find these clips. Since it is a tree, we will just type in tree, click enter. And now we have successfully added this clip into our smart bins by using keywords. So we can go down to smart bins, click on toggle keyword, and right under keywords, you will see that there is a clip titled tree. And now we've utilized our smart bins slash keywords. Now let's do the same for the rest of the clips. Now that we're done utilizing keywords for our smart bin, we're going to scroll this up and now we can see all the bins that we've created under smart bins. Click on tree. We have the tree clip, click on fire. We have the fire clip, same thing with the sparks and the woods. Now that you've organized your clips into all of these smart bins and master bins, you are ready to start editing. So we're going to go down here, click on edit. And now you can see that your master bins and also your smart bins are all located here in the edit section. Now we want to create a timeline. So we go up to the master bin, we right click, and then we go to new bin. We're going to name that bin timeline one. And then we click on that timeline, right click again, and then we create timeline create new timeline there we have our timeline settings we click create and there you have a new timeline where you can sort the footage that you have in order to create a cohesive video
If you guys do have any questions, please feel free to comment down below. Thank you guys for watching. Bye-bye.